Leger Reads just sent me a little gift package with their new French Cut Reads. So let's open it up and give them a try. Full disclosure, I am a Leger sponsored artist. So whenever they have new products, they send them my way to try them out. Leger sent me 10 reads, five alto and five tenor. But for this video, I'm just gonna be playing alto. They sent me 2.25, 2.5 and 2.75. So I currently play a Leger American Cut 2.25 strength. Throughout this video, you might hear me say strength or size. The more accurate term is strength, but saxophone players oftentimes say read size as well. So uh, just because I play a 2.25 read strength on the American cut, that does not mean that I will necessarily play a 2.25 on the French cut. So reads, even within the same brand, different models of reads, have different cuts and different profiles that make their uh, strength a little bit different from read to read, from read type to read type. Because the 2.25 on the American cut fits me really well, that does not mean the 2.25 in the French cut is gonna fit. That's why Leger sent me a couple different sizes to play. Okay, before I do the play test, this is what Leger says about their French cut reads. Introducing the French cut by Leger, a refined symphonic read that gives players a richness and stability in tone without any sacrifice to response. With a profile that has been completely reimagined, the French cut has been designed for a dark center tone that allows for a deep range of emotional expression. The read is responsive, but even with the perfect amount of resistance. This sounds like it might be a little bit more of a darker classical read, but I have a very bright setup uh, with my Barclay Brazil Custom Pop 7 Blue mouthpiece. It's a really high baffle mouthpiece. So playing a darker read might be just what I need to tone down the darkness just a little bit. Now, I usually prefer something that is a little more free blowing. And this one says that it has uh, more resistance. I usually don't go for more resistance, but let's see how this works on the saxophone. To start off, I'm gonna play with my regular setup, which again is the Legere American Cut 2.25, just to give us a reference so that you can compare apples to apples. Pro tip for anyone who struggles opening up a Legere box, which I did for years, if you open it from the bottom, it pulls right out. Super easy. If you try to open it from the top, it's way, way, way more difficult. First up is a Legere French Cut 2.25. All right, I really like this read. Uh, I think the 2.25 might be a little bit soft for me, but it's very responsive. It's got a big full sound. It's really easy to play on. Um, again, I feel like I could overblow on this read really easily, so I'm ready to try the 2.5, but I really like the feel and sound of this read. It really projects. Let me know in the comments which read you think sounds the best and why. Your choices are my regular setup, the American Cut 2.25, French Cut 2.25, 2.5, or 2.75. Let's try a 2.5.
Okay, the 2.5 is definitely a better fit for me. The thing that I really notice about this reed is its dynamic range. You can get really soft really easily. It has really crisp articulations. Uh, it's got a fat sound to it. I'm really digging these reeds. All right, I think the 2.5 is definitely a better fit. I can really tell that I have more dynamics uh, than I did on the 2.25 and it's a little bit crisper and it just feels a lot easier to play, a lot better to play. I'm getting the correct amount of resistance. Just like with cane reeds, synthetic reeds take a little bit of time to break in. So uh, this 2.5 might end up being a little bit too soft after playing on it for a week or two. So I'm gonna go ahead and try the 2.75 and see how that feels. Okay, the 2.75 definitely feels too stiff for me. I like the 2.5 a lot better, although I was surprised I was able to play those low notes that soft. But the 2.75 is not the right strength for me. If you've been following my channel or seen me on Instagram for a while, you know that I rarely change gear. The last time I changed anything with my setup was when uh, Legere came out with the American Cut Reeds. I went from the Signature Reed to the American Cut, which I liked a lot more. I'm gonna play on this 2.5 French cut for a week or so and see how I feel about it. Uh, and then I'll put up another video, most likely in my shorts, letting you know how I like it after playing, it for, playing on it for about a week or so. Let me know in the comments which read you think sounds best, either the American cut, my regular setup, or the French cut, 2.25, 2.5, or 2.75. Would you like for me to do more sax gear videos? If so, leave me a comment below letting me know what you'd like me to try next. Thanks for taking the time to check out this video. If you'd like to dive deeper into my saxophone world, come check me out at the Scott Paddock Sax School.